Alright. Hope you're all ready for Peach v Peach. Best of five grand finals. Probably not going to be a reset, to be perfectly honest. I would be shocked, uh, but that would be kind of sick. And Catherine, man, if Catherine won, that'd be nuts. I don't see it, but, you know. Doing the jumping jacks, there we go. McLeod doing it too, but it, he's off screen, unfortunately. Uh, there we go. All right. Da -da. All right, they're gonna have a quick, quick break, quick uh, bathroom break, just to, before everything happens. And then we're gonna see some peach on peach action. Which, you know, as a relatively new peach uh, player, at least I currently am, I don't understand how that matchup works, but I, I believe it's something about you want to be a bit higher than the opponent, generally. If you're coming down with a move, you are both kind of floating. So you generally want to be above the opponent. Uh, other than that, you know, I'm still figuring it out. Turnip's probably pretty good, but... Damn, Catherine with the zero to death on Mr. Enemy Stand over there. We're practicing a ledge dashes, I like to see it. Damn! Yeah, she got she ledge dashed. I think the galint might have been negative thirteen, but come out of that. I probably that's probably even more than that. Damn. Damn. Maybe I should play Moth. I don't know. Who knows? Maybe I should go back to Tarko. Who knows? None of that's important. What matters is this Grand Finals. Catherine's beaten McLeod before. When has he beaten McLeod before? I don't know. How long ago was that? I was definitely. I remember when he first when he first joined the scene. She's surely beat him around then. I don't know. I guess I haven't been paying that close attention because I don't go to all the events. But that'd be kind of a couple of months ago. That's kind of funny. Was he playing Peach in the Ditto? That's kind of wild, if true. Damn. Can you imagine if she if she wins this then that's like you know, one musket didn't make it but the other musket came home. Came home with a prize. Can you imagine? Alright. Yeah, I don't think there we go. Yeah, I, I don't believe this is I believe this to be some sort of hair wobbers, folks. I don't think it's a legitimate match. But <laughs> I wonder if it was. If it is, Catherine's up right now. Oh, uh, a convincing four stock. Game one. Man, Falco sucks. Tish Grand Finals Depth, that's crazy. That was cool to see. Because I, 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 most of the time I've been in this scene, I feel like there hasn't been too many like upsets or like, you know, it's been a lot of like. Good players win, you know, and the good players, you know, don't tend to, it doesn't tend to be a lot of new good players, but, you know, McLeod's here now and he's good. Catherine's son beat better and better players, it feels like. Just kind of nuts. Muffy's back in the scene. Yeah, this ditto works is, uh, I don't really know. I don't really know. All I know is that you kind of probably want to be above the opponent. It's probably a better idea, or at least like a little bit higher than them if you're both uh, if you're both like floating with an arrow. It's like the one thing that I have any idea of. Right. Yeah, 
turnips seem pretty good. Peach, I mean, she's not that far. She can't, like, punish herself for pulling this out too easily. And that she's close. Uh, I don't know, because Peach, you might just catch the stitch and throw it back. At least she's there by any match. Right there. But, uh, I think Peach is definitely a matchup that can, that can actually kind of snowball. At least I've seen it kind of snowball. Which doesn't seem like it would, but... Because, like, McLe they're both pretty, like, even percent right now, but if McLeod takes the first stock here, like, say, let's say he cleans it up with, like, one more random hit on the like, throw. Well, let's say Catherine takes the first stock now. Like, she can get a couple of straight hits, and, like, it, just, it feels like it kind of snowballs. At least when I play it. But maybe that's because I'm not good. Or worse than the people playing against. Alright. True. True. It is going to be a slog, Mr. Beach player. Wait, right, sorry, Puff player. My mistake. Nice. The layered offense there. Setting up with the turn up. Following up with the L forward there. Ooh! I like that. You could have avoided the uh, snap of the turn up and avoided her turn up. Jabs. Jab seems like a pretty good option in this matchup. We can kind of like, it's a decent anti air. Really fast and can kind of link to the other options like the dash up there. Alright, forward air. Ooh. Goes for the dash there. Let's make it. Yeah, McLeod, he is down. Alright. Maybe Captain just has the superior fundies. With experimental, I don't know. Something about her. Think about it. There you go. We fell out a bit higher, higher up. Falls down with the Thorda and beats uh, Captain's Thorda. Alright, nice recognition there, grabbing the ledge. Very close competitive match. Only a 9% difference, which is, you know, not the thing at all. Oh, we've, uh. The stream's, the stream's frozen. Huh. Uh, I don't know where Kai is. We normally fix this. One second. Hmm. Looking kind of scary without the, the head poncho to fix things. Uh, maybe. Probably. Ah, hey. I can do that, I can do that, I can do uh, that, but yeah, the game is, uh, I mean, you can still hear it happening. Yeah, the stream is frozen. Peach is winning. Let me see if I can find the bus. Try unplugging and replugging things really nearly, but um, I don't know. I don't know about that one. Uh, let me see if I can contact him.
All right, update, update. For any gamers still in the chat, uh, looks like we we'll have to wait for Kai to get back. But Catherine did win game one. Catherine did win game one. So for all the Catherine fans, big pog, big pog. Kai probably couldn't be too far away. Be in the vicinity, I would suggest. Tell you what, I'll just try and see if I can try and relay the. This cape's probably not long enough to go over there. Or is it? No, it's not quite long enough for me to go stand over there and just tell you what's happening on screen. That would be exciting. Uh, huh. I guess we can amuse ourselves, right? Yeah, it probably is a cup charge issue. I, I think you could, earlier he, uh, he played with some cables and did something, I just, you know, I'm not probably not confident enough to go in there and mess with this setup when I don't know what all of it is, does and uh, what's all safe or not. Oh, he's returned. Hey. Yeah. Unfortunate. All right, he's returned. There we go. All right, I can't touch it until this game's over. Oh, okay. Because they'll lose signal. Oh, okay. Yeah. So right. that's the unfortunate truth. Well, there you go. Well, game one, Kath we do know that Catherine won. This game, we don't know much. All right, I wish I could stand over there, but this cable's not quite long that's enough. That's a fucking shame, actually. Yeah. That's a damn shame. Unfortunately, this cable's not quite long enough for me to go stand nah, over don't, there. No, don't, don't, don't try. Don't even and, try. Uh, <laughs> I would not even try. And uh, give the play-by-play. Let me go get an update on the stock count for all those inquisitive gamers. Yeah, because what the issue is, is like, I have to, um, nah, this is a capture card issue, this isn't, oh, this isn't like an issue with like, okay, two stocks each apparently, basically what's happened is, like the capture card that I'm using, it's n it's not one of the ulti guys at all, it's just, it's my own. Two to one? Okay. That sounds like it might be one to one now. Oh, now it's two to one. Never mind. So you, so you know what's funny? I would actually have a method here of like, um, <laughs> I actually would have a method here of like, getting some crazy sick other angle. But um, basically, what I still think that it would interrupt the stream, unfortunately, which is a shame. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with my um, my USBs today, but yeah, it's a damn shame. So. Did this happen in the first game? Alright, who won? Alright, I just have to do... I have to... you lose signal for a second. Alright. Yes, one one. Can lose audio for a second. Don't have found the dreams. There we go. We might be back in the business. Game is very loud, apparently. How about now? How are those audio levels? How's that, folks? That should be all right Whoa. now. Well, yeah. Much better. Just including that. Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Everything's loud. Wasn't that good? 
Okay, hang You on. can adjust on it's, your end if everything's... Yeah, it's because I had my window settings changed. Uh, That's what happened. Good old windows. Good old windows. Always changing, updating. Never even asked for it. All right, that should be fine for you now, folks. We shouldn't be like peaking too hard either. Like, whoa, yeah, it's just the old cable having issues right now. You know how it is with these peach dudes, they're volatile. Any any straight hit? Alright. I can probably use this headset now. I can probably use this headset like this now, and we should be fine. Apologies for all the little technical hiccups we're having today. I'm not sure why they're occurring. Okay, but personally, I blame Ultimate. But what about that gameplay though? The gameplay is fine now. Pretty That's fun. a thing. Anyway. So I'm literally having to hold on to the cable connected to my ears with my hands like coiled up. It's really funny. So can you believe we have Peach Peach Grand Finals, folks? I can't. I can believe it. I mean, when half of the field almost was Peach Peach. Well, that's true, yeah. I just can't believe it because, you know, I lost. Crazy. <laughs> Catherine gotten really good lately. Definitely coming to all the events. So, yeah. you know, you got to have a game plan when you're fighting her. Take your names. Hmm. And like you can see these two, close. they're playing pretty closely together as well. Yeah, not too far off. Not too shabby. Although this game's probably fairly McLeod favoured at this point. This stock lead. Oh my god, these turnips and these down smashes. Uh, I'm so sad I'm not in finals, bro. I'm so sad I didn't get to play coffee. Oh my god. Rip. It's alright. Oh, the ping pong. I definitely don't feel as bad on the inside anymore, but you know. Yeah. Oh my god, get called out. That was swag. Slap. So which, um... What colour wiggle would Urien be? <laughs> uh, blue. He's Anthony. Yeah? Absolutely. He's got that dog in him? <laughs> yeah. Definitely. Urien the type of dude to film a promotional spot for the St. Vincent de Paul Society. You know what I'm saying? No, I don't. But you don't, you don't know. I, you don't know Vinny's. Same I feel. I, I feel it. But I don't know it. Oh my god! I don't understand anything about this ditto. I don't know. I don't like. Sometimes you think you know something about melee, and then, oh my god, what is happening? How many players really know this matchup? Not many. Hey. Can't be that many. Can't be that many. Oh my god. There aren't that many Peach players outside of this team, and certainly not that many Peach players that have ever been really good. Okay, well, Lemons, you'll enjoy this, I think. Yeah. Toph asked recently, is there more... Oh, is the lasers is versus it, human beings? Yeah, is there more people in the world or lasers shot in... So, in, when Falco I... Falco lasers shot. Yeah, Falco lasers shot in all of Melee's lifetime or people currently alive today. Mm -hmm. uh, my instinct was humans alive today must have been must be larger, but then... I was reading people through people's reasoning. It does seem to make sense that actually it could be Falco lasers. So I had lasers. the opposite. I had the opposite experience. I instantly thought lasers at first, but then thinking about the maths, I actually am inclined to say that it's humans because, like, 7.7 .7 billion is quite a lot. Of, it's quite a lot right. of number. Right. There are some numbers of like if you expect like X, like 10,000 Falco players shooting like so many lasers per matches. How many matches that actually kind of works out to be a pretty big number. I don't know. Yeah, because look, the way I see this, right, there's probably less than 7,000 people played like playing Falco with like short hop lasers right. in the world, right? Like probably across all time. All of time. But there's probably less than 7,000 people in the world doing short hop laser with Falco across all time. There's less than 7,000. 7,000? I would say so. Really? Yeah. Across 20 years? 7,000. Yeah, it's like a decent number of people play this game. I don't think... I don't even think 5,000 people actively play this game. 
or today? Yeah. I don't think 5,000 people actively play this game. Really? Like on Slippy and stuff. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I don't know the stats. I just I just don't know the stats. Because my, yeah, my gut reaction was human beings, because 8 billion or whatever was a lot. But, uh, you know, I just, I just remember seeing some maps that looked fairly, like, reasonable. Like, right. well, hmm, maybe it could be. Anyway. So, one, I don't think there's more than 7,000 people playing Falco with short hop laser. Well, let's say there are 7,000 Falco players across 20 years. Okay, yep. Right. If they all, okay, even if they, they even if they all shot 1 million lasers over their lifetime, it would still, that would, that's only 7 billion. Right. That's only 7 billion. Right. right? So you'd need some more Falco players, probably. Almost certainly. Seven, even seven if there was 7,000 Falco players shooting short hop lasers. 7 million is too much, for sure. I mean, let's say, I mean, let's say you play like you have a, uh, like a week every every week you have one gaming night, of three hours, and you have like what, like thirty games or something. I don't, know, I don't know how that works out. Let's say you get thirty games a week of Falco, which is maybe average, maybe not. I don't know. How many lasers per game do you think there would be? Like a hundred? You you can max out at a hundred. I would say. I would say like in an, in one game you would max out at a hundred, right? Like, yeah. but you don't, right? You never actually What's shoot like the 100. Average game length, like four minutes. No, the average game length is like two. Mm, Honestly, I think it depends on the matchup. Anyway, so what I'm saying is, one, I don't think there's even 7,000 short hop lasering Falcos in the world. Two, even if they all shot one million lasers, that's only seven billion, and there's 7.4 or 7.7 .7 billion. I just think there are more Falco players than that across 20 years. I don't think so. I just don't. I just don't see it. I mean, if you also include like not just the dedicated people, but the people who just play, pick up the game, you know, because mainly right, sold well, a GG's. lot of copies. Well done to McLeod. Oh, well, <laughs> wait a minute. Well done to McLeod. Wait Yay. a minute. Yay! I don't know, because like even if you think about the people who just like apparently you mainly sold like seven million copies or something, or maybe a couple of million it, copies. It sold like twenty-one. You get copies. There's worldwide. twenty-five characters in the game, or like twenty-six. You, you know, one twenty-fifth of the players, but probably a little bit more. I think Falco is maybe slightly more popular, perhaps, than some other characters in terms of just casual player base. Mm. Uh, and then just you think of all the times they just press B on this side of the stage. But it doesn't add up. Th yeah, like, th th do you think those people are going to shoot a million lasers in a lifetime? Probably not. No, right? but there's a lot of them. I don't think there's seven that. million copies yeah. of the game. Uh, I don't know. They they uh, they they're a part of the equation. Yeah, they are, but like I just don't see how like fiction alone. How many is that gonna be? <laughs> no, the real the real laser shooter is Zangazen. Yeah, that's the real laser shooters. I uh, look. I think we will never come to a conclusion on this. No, we but need the stats. but just know, like you, it's based on your assumptions, and it's yeah. based on your assumptions that you have to make. You do have to make assumptions. I don't know. I think seven thousand is a low ball. Fuck your players. <laughs> I guess. Well, actually, I guess Falco players maybe. How many, what's can the we can of, we bring up the, the can we bring up the Zangazen Luigi kid set? Hang on. Oh yeah. I'm bringing this up. For the stream. Ow. Uh -oh. Ow, fuck's sake. You got too excited. Zangazen versus Luigi kid. Yeah. Let me let me see this shit. It's the one where he, uh, <laughs> he did he walk off the stage in that one? I don't remember. Oh, it's, this is the worst shit ever. <laughs> it's actually the most. Wait, is it this one? Is it Luigi Kid? I feel like it's. I've definitely seen like a highlight reel of like. Is it this someone one? getting shot to like 200% and then killing Hang himself? Zeng is in late. Hang on. Just I'm finding this. I'm actually finding this. It's important. That is, that is some pretty broken. Let me see this. Twitter tech from Tove. Somebody, yeah, yeah, right. The the easiest farming of impressions yeah. of all time. The next level on the Lions versus Pokemon. But where do you fall in Here Lions we go. versus Pokemon? It is Zangazin versus G Money. Oh my god. Okay, that's it. Zang there you go. It's a 20, 250 lasers in five minutes. How many minutes? How many, you're not, how many minutes? You're not going to shoot 250 lasers every game. How many minutes are there in 20 years? Oh, <laughs> you are not going to shoot 250 la lasers in but every maybe game. Maybe if they were playing correctly, they would be. You would, you would not. What is your answer to that? 8 billion people versus lasers. He I, th I think it's people. 
that was my I, my gut feeling was lasers at first, and then I'm like, I think it's people. So my actually. gut feeling, but was, it's based on assumptions. My gut feeling was people, and then I read some I read some fairly convincing Twitter math that was like, mm, maybe it could be lasers. Do you know how much is a? Do you know how much one billion is, bro? It's a lot, but the math, the, but the math, the assumptions they were making didn't seem that unreasonable to me, and the math they made seemed to work out. It's a lot. All right, I don't stream, know. Personally, I think, I think the Pokemon would win. All right, surely Stream can hear this you know, too. Because you only need one godlike Pokemon to win. Like, All right. No matter how many you have. We're bringing this one up. But, oh, bring it up. We're bringing it, we're, we're bringing it up for the, for the folks at home. I'll die on the Lemons Hill. <laughs> I'll die on the Lemons Hill. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I can think about, yeah, the fact that it's on Twitter doesn't make a difference, bro. Oh, no. God, this stream quality. Hey. If it's, if the math works out, it works out. It doesn't matter where you got it from. I guess. You have Reddit math, and it would still be convincing. All right. All right, we're all gonna enjoy this now. All right. We're nice. all gonna enjoy this. Okay. This is this is the actual grand finals of Cheese League. Do you want to make it a bit bigger for the stream? No. No. Yeah. They need to see us. Okay. You can watch, you guys. You can go, you can go to YouTube. You got a computer. But we need it all synced up <laughs> for the communal viewing experience. <laughs> you can watch it here. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, yeah, it, Twitter. There's some mathematicians on Twitter. Let's just say that. Look, look. Like I, like I'm standing by what I say, right? Mm -hmm. Which is, I don't think there's seven thousand Falco players who have ever done short hop lasers. Like, do you, 7,000. Mm, it's a lot. 7,000. It's a lot. I guess when you divide like, it just down to Falco like players. Like, there's, there's only, like, maybe 200 tops melee players in Australia. Tops. Sure. Right? There's, and, like, the highest yeah. entrant tournaments in America. A lot of people play Falco. They, they, don't, they don't even get to 2,000 players, right? Mm. How many games do you think are played each day? Hmm? Oh, I mean, well, I don't with know. Slippy, it's going to be well, like lots, than, right? Than all. But but still, like what I'm saying is Falco, like one of the most popular netplay characters. Well, yeah, but like what I'm saying is like I don't think there's a volume large enough of Falco yeah. across all of melee history. I think doing when, short hop laser. I think what you're then, saying makes and, like, sense. And like playing enough to playing enough to shoot one million lasers in their lifetime each. Mm. Because that's still not even more than seven billion. Yeah, that's true. I mean, yeah, what you're saying makes sense. I just don't know. The, I mean, we just don't know the numbers. Well, yeah, we obviously don't have the numbers. We'll never have the numbers because it's impossible to track. But mm. that's just the that's way I Slippy's see it. That's what Slippy's for. Slippy yeah. 2.0 will be able to track that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just enjoying some some good old fashioned short hop lasers. What? Slippy games versus non slippies. No. Yeah, I don't think so either. No. There's too many, too many years. It's been, it's too, yeah, it's been too long. Not yet. Even though that obviously the volume of games would be higher on Slippy, but no. And how many, like, how many years has Slippy been? Right. Like, like five years or something? Five, six years? Okay, like kind of like, kind of like competitive one v one games. Yeah. Yeah. No. I don't yeah, think not, so either. Not more Slippy games than total. Yeah, definitely in two years. Definitely, absolutely. Because it's heaps. There's so many games. Yeah. Just kind of nuts to think, because you would think then the player base would just get better and better and better at a faster rate. God, this is such a funny fucking set. Oh, my God. This set's so funny. Holy shit. This set is so fucking funny. Zangazin's just like, yeah, sick, I'm a stock up versus Martha and FD. I'm not doing anything except laser. Until he misses a laser. and. Oh, this is so goes. bad to watch, too. Oh, the tick crap. This this is so bad to watch too. We're all this is how we're ending Cheese League. All yeah. right. You don't get a choice. <laughs> well, you could always leave. Huh? Uh, you can unplug everything Ooh. there actually. Like Damn. just just like um, just take like that tripod off that TV, and but you can unplug everything that's in the TV and on the um, power board there. That's fine. Yeah, we're we're all watching this. This set this set sucks. <laughs> this set actually sucks so bad. Yeah. Not even I play like this on FD versus a Martha can't punish. I don't know. Zangazen versus G Money, where he shoots 250 lasers. Because I'm using this as an example. Yeah. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. I've heard about it, but I haven't seen the match. Um, okay. Actually, who would win? Okay. When do, uh, okay. do you fall in the Billion Lions debate? The what? The, the Billion, billion Lions, Lions, which okay, is one what? of every Pokemon. <laughs> How many Pokemon are there? Uh, it's like 500 or something at this point. Six, 700 maybe, I think. I forget. It's something like 500 to 700, I think. Um, currently. So my my position is Pokemon just because... How many Lions? A billion. One billion. So my position is Pokemon just because there are some Pokemon that in the lore at least... In the lore, at least, are like godlike. They're like godlike beings. Well, yeah. So, so Arceus like you only just, need like one. Yeah. All right. To win. GG, Zang. He only won by one stock. That's fucked. Um. One billion is a lot of okay. Yeah, but you only need one god. Yeah. That so can can't Arceus, possibly can lose. Can just yeah. like? No, if you have a god, you can't lose. So what? What moves does Arceus? You literally Arceus can't know? lose. I don't know. I'm just talking about the lore. Yeah, but so so Arceus created all Pokemon. Did he create all animals? No. I'm talking oh, about like if, if you had like if you had like Yahweh versus a billion lions, who do you think would win? What's that? What? Like the the Abrahamic God, Jesus versus a billion lions. Well, not Jesus, but well, Jesus, whatever. Yeah, but like you literally only need one like godlike being who's untouchable. It doesn't matter how many you have. You could have a, three times as many. You know, that's a lot. Three billion. That's a lot of lions. What if the, what if so yeah, well, yeah, what's like the bounds? What's the bounds of the arena? <laughs> <laughs> like is it just like, I, feel okay, like, I, feel like it I feel like it doesn't matter the open scenario field. like God can't lose you know what I mean <laughs> that's a what's the word for that puritanical almost no it's like what's the word for that I mean they can't lose just because it's it's like it's an omniscient being it's God you know like like you know like could a billion lions defeat the sun you know like they can't because yeah how could the they sun? do it yeah it's like uh, to me it's the same sort of thing is there a Pokemon or that even can a, sun, a sun? I don't know. Maybe they can. Maybe there's a billion is enough to like blot out the sun. You know, like they could burn it up. I don't know. if That's possible. But. Can Pokemon create a sun? Maybe. I don't know. There's probably some Pokemon that's like. I pr I'm pretty sure there's some Pokemon in the lore that's apparently like as hot as a sun or whatever. Like they'd say, oh, it burns as hot as the sun. I'm sure there's mm. something like that. Which is like you know, because like yeah, I mean some people have made arguments about like Charizard can fly and breathe fire. But, like yeah, a billion is going to overcome that eventually. He's going to have to land. He's going to get tired. Can't kill a billion lions on his own. He's gonna die. Um, Is there any Pokemon that can just? No, wait. But actually, you know what? Pokemon wins because Deoxys exists and Deoxys can levitate, and that's. But he he, he can die eventually, right? Deoxys he is, is in space. He's in space. I guess. Well, there you go. It's a stalemate. Like no, okay, folks. Nobody actually wins that. I think, I think because you have to kill Deoxys and he lives in space. The thing is, a billion is a lot, and they would they would win. Even, even a really powerful Pokemon is going to lose to a billion lions. There's no, but you just need one like godlike being or like yeah, because you have to you have to kill just, every Pokemon. They can't overcome. You have to kill every Pokemon. So yeah, and that's over. Yeah, I'm Team Pokemon on this one actually. Yeah. Well, you you can't shut up, shut up, Garfield. It's true though. Like what is what is one what is one billion lions gonna do about Deoxys that can be anywhere in space? Nothing. Yeah. So so one billion lions can't actually couldn't, kill every Pokemon. That's actually, just confirmed. Actually, how many is a billion? Because a billion. I was gonna say Kyogre. Kyogre, Kyogre, could, Kyogre could probably like you know cause a global flood or something. But I don't know if um, mm. can they all. So I guess they probably can't, aren't. But I don't. Obviously, obviously lions would drown. But like. How many is a billion? Could, would, would there be enough that would they just be like stand above the waves? You know what I mean? Mm. And then you know, eventually yeah. Kyogre will probably lose because a billion is a ton. But I don't, I don't know about the the circumference of the Earth, a billion lions, how that factors. Yeah, Lax is right here. You can't you can't actually beat Relicanthus lions because you can't reach the bottom of the fucking ocean. No, it's not one billion of Pokemon. It's one of every Pokemon versus and a billion lions. Yeah, one of every Pokemon versus a billion lions, and not and one of every Pokemon will not. God, a billion lions beats a lot of stuff. Yeah, it, it will beat most of the Pokemon, at, but Almost not all of them. them. Like e e yeah, even like Charizard or something, he flies up there, breathes fire. Eventually, he's gonna come down. He's gonna die. But like, yeah, you know, there's such a tidal right. way of lions. Well, there's no hope. But I'm glad we got to the bottom of that one. You need yeah, you have one godlike being that just actually just can't be touched. There's like a hundred zero matchup. Yeah, it doesn't matter how many you, you stack lions you stack up. Then you know it's over. yeah. Let, At least I mean, going look, by some lore, but you know, in-game Pokemon, you know, obviously. I think of lines would probably that win is actually the they truth. They just sit there and do moves, and I'm and so happy turns. that we got to the bottom of that. Yeah. Um. And folks, it's time for us. Who to end would this win? Stream. 
Who would win? One of every Pokemon or one billion Falcolizers? I have... Okay, I have to actually host you off, folks, because I can't keep waffling on and okay. keeping people here. So, How many? we are going to go to DreamHack Rotterdam, folks. What about one billion lions shooting lasers, fucker lasers? <laughs> That's the worst <laughs> question ever. <laughs> All right, we are out of here. I'm just going to host you off to BTS Smash because you know how it be. Just right. keep watching keep watching Smash. Yeah. You know, you know where to go. Um, but a better question is, who would win... One billion. Yeah, one billion, one billion does have an amazing matchup spread. You're who would? Right. Who would? Um. Yeah. Who would actually win? One billion Twitch shatters or three minute ad break? All right. Ooh. Good night. Good night, everyone. Have a good time. I'll see you next time. It's been real. Um. <laughs> we got him, boys. All right. Peace out, y'all. Have a good night. Oh.